So, we have not filmed in a couple months now, but we've been doing a lot of stuff in the past two months. We went to a big boat show in Seattle and went to a ton of really cool seminars to prepare ourselves for Mexico. We learned a lot of really good stuff and then obviously took a lot of notes. And then Colby had to go to Dutch Harbor, Alaska for a rotation at his, at his job. He is a marine electronics technician. And he was gone for about a month and a half this time. Then we went to Georgia and had a really fun wedding party. And uh, we had a lot of fun. Yes, this is Colby dancing with my father as a father-in-law, son-in-law dance. And uh, then took some really cute pictures, I think. And then I just worked on cleaning out the apartment by myself while Colby was in Alaska. So, yeah. Today isn't a very exciting day because we're moving the boat finally to Seattle. And our permanent live aboard slip. Yep. Permanent until August. Yep. So... We are, it's still deeply in project mode. We are going to be in project mode until we gut this place. Uh, so. Unfortunately, while we're doing this, we also have to move out by the end of next week, by next Sunday. And our apartment is still, still a mess. Yeah. So, still a lot of stuff. So all that footage that you saw of our our apartment looking crazy it still looks like that yeah <laughs> and it will look like that until next week yep so uh we're moving the, we're just moving the boat we'll end up living aboard and it will still look like this but hopefully when we start living aboard we've got on gutting pretty much the entire place yeah we're gonna take everything out and then and then start organizing and really like deep cleaning because like all of this needs to be deep cleaned yep. and like all of this needs to be taken out but yeah there's a bunch start of from basically zero again yeah. so but good thing is that means you'll see a lot of new videos because i'm gonna be filming try to every single day um like everything i do so yeah anyways all right let's get ready to push off pleasant harbor forever Forever, never gonna be back never here. Never gonna be back. We'll come back to visit Dennis. Oh, such a good marketer. Okay. All right. Talk to you later. Bye. <laughs>
so which is like the other end of Seattle yeah we're like up here in West Seattle you know it's down there so that's fun um, we're really hoping that it's there it's like noon so hopefully the address that it got delivered to either these people are home and they're nice and they're not real pieces of shit and we can like show them he has his card it, it's crazy because the reason he got sent to the wrong address is because one letter one, southwest one letter and west. and west i said avenue west is is what the address i meant to send it to and i think what happened is starlink when you put it in the address they do like do you mean this address and maybe we're in a rush or something because i know i ordered when we were in georgia i don't know what anyway um said avenue it must have said Avenue Southwest, but I thought it said Avenue West. Yep, that's the one. I clicked yep. it, and then it got shipped, and never never thought about it again until today. I got a picture of it's been delivered, and I'm like, a picture of delivery? That's weird, because I got it shipped to my work, which they would have okay. gone inside yeah. and delivered to someone. So I was like, huh. And I look up the shipping address, and it says Avenue Southwest, and that is not where it's supposed to be. It is a private residence. It looks like it's just a house. So, yeah, I guess we'll update you when we get there. We got it. It was it was behind a gate that said no trespassing. And then like a locked gate. And a locked gate <laughs> at that. Um, but it was like right there. And so if these people have cameras, they for sure think we just stole their package. I, I did confirm it said Colby Trentman on yeah, the package. We we did look. It yeah. does say his name, so it is ours. <laughs> but um, it did take some maneuvering. I had to get under the gate and like push it up, and then he had to grab on top of it. So. If they have cameras, they definitely saw us, but I don't even care because it's ours and we got it and we did not just lose all that money no. to get it. So we have it there she is. and we're gonna go home and set it up. It looks so much different in here now that it's empty. Ah. Goodbye to the place we spent three years and got married. We're officially done. We did it. We did it, babe. We did do it. Barely. We're just waiting for our inspection. Wow, my hair looks crazy. We got done at like 11 o'clock last night. And yeah, like I just said we're waiting for the move out inspection so we can Fingers crossed, get our security deposit back. My hair is all going really crazy, sorry about that. Yeah, mine that. is too, so. But long day at work. Anyways. But yeah, anyways, um, well, I hope that you enjoyed this video. It, uh, it's gonna be weird. We've been filming a lot for the past couple of months, but I didn't know how to like put it all into one cohesive video, so. It's gonna be like a move out, moving into the boat, weird hodgepodge of a video but I hope you enjoyed it now that we are fully on the boat now though we're gonna be filming a lot more because we have a lot of projects we need to do we officially have about 90 days until our sale date so I have a lot of work to be doing during the day and then we both have a lot of work to be doing during the weekend so i'm excited for my first solo project to see how it turns out but anyways we will see you in the next one bye